name's Jasmine and I work for Inland Empire Resource Conservation District, or IERCD for short. We've partnered with the City of San Bernardino Municipal Water Department to bring you a series of virtual lessons on water education and conservation. For our third lesson, we're going to observe a density phenomena, and then I'm going to explain the science behind what's happening. You will need water, a clear or light colored dish, I've selected one with rounded edges so that it can hold a good amount of water, dry erase markers, and I'd also suggest having a cloth napkin or towel nearby, just in case. Okay, let's get started. Start by having a conversation about density. Talk about what items sink or float and have the children hypothesize why they think that this happens. Now, draw on your plate. Pour your water over your drawing. What do you see? What do you notice? What do you wonder about? Your little scientist might want to know what's happening in this phenomena. The ink in the dry erase markers is insoluble. That means that it can't be dissolved in liquid. And more importantly, it is also less dense than water. When you pour water onto a dry erase drawing on a smooth surface, a strong buoyancy force overcomes the stickiness of the ink, pulling the drawing off of the surface and causing it to float on the water. Now that you know what's happening in this phenomena, try this activity for yourself and teach your friends and family. Visit the City of San Bernardino Municipal Water Department's website to access this video, resource links, and an activity write-up in English and in Spanish. Tell us how you liked the lesson in the comments below and tag us in any photos or videos of you doing this activity. Thank you from the City of San Bernardino Municipal Water Department and from everyone at IARCD. We appreciate you watching. Take care.